forms of identity construction. You can lounge around here on her sofa in her ex-husband's dead tech post-modernistic bullshit house if you want to. And they fall back on traditional methods. Pacino looks to his work and De Niro looks to relationships. All I know is there's no point in me going anywhere anymore. It's gonna be alone. In this way, Michael Mann's attention to style, in score, in soundtrack, in lenses, in locations, in wardrobe, in lighting, and his attention to realism as well, all those same as its drawbacks. And that's what film noir was always meant to do at its best, show the underside of culture and why it's a necessary extension of the reverse. In fact, it may be the case in our modern culture that when the two sides are put face to face, they don't look all that different.